Thanks for joining today's video, where here we have a math problem that we're going to work through together, and we're also going to go over a common mistake that some people may make when solving a problem just like this. The problem is 10 plus 10 times 10 minus 10. So a lot of people when seeing this problem will just work from left to right. So first they're going to add 10 plus 10, which we know gives us 20, and then they're going to multiply that 20 by 10, which we know is going to give us 200, and then they're going to subtract 10 from 200, which is going to give us 190. So our answer should be B, 190. But if we work through the problem this way, then we would get the incorrect answer because we didn't follow the order of operations here. So let's go ahead and work through this problem together, except this time we're going to make sure that we're following the order of operations. The original problem was 10 plus 10 times 10 minus 10. So since we have multiple operations within this problem, we need to make sure that we're following the order of operations here. And over on the left hand side, we can see the acronym PEMDAS, which stands for the order of priorities when solving problems just like this. The P stands for parentheses and the E stands for exponents. And since we don't have either one of those, we're going to move on to our next priority of multiplication or division. And here we do have multiplication, so we're going to multiply 10 times 10, which we know gives us 100, then we're going to bring down the rest of the problem. So we have 10 plus 100 minus 10. So since we don't have any more multiplication or division to deal with, we're going to move on to our last priority of adding or subtracting. And here, since we're going to be adding 10 and we're going to be taking away 10, they're going to cancel each other out. So that means that our answer here is going to be 1. So our answer is A, 100. If you enjoyed this video, then please smash those like and subscribe buttons. As always, enjoy today's math journey.